Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Also, yeah, by the way, like today, like there was like a teaser for a Sido Corsa Evo. So apparently it's launching like early next year, right? Early 2025. Does anybody know? Will it have mod support? I saw that it has like AI traffic. That's pretty cool. Like by default. But, uh... Do we have like mod support like in the previous game or do we not know that yet? I mean if it doesn't have mod support then you know not really high for it. Uh, but today we we're actually in Forge Rosen 5 because recently we have been getting some new cars in Forge Rosen 5. The first car actually you can get through the festival playlist. Toyota Chase GT TD 91. Uh, <laughs> so we're gonna try to get the TD the other way. We're gonna try to auction snipe it because do you think I'm gonna play the game? to get the car no forza stop forcing me to play the game at the auction house we are gonna find chance gt td 91 there it is we're not gonna play the game we're gonna auction snipe it we have a timer as well i want to know how long it takes the community actually wanted this car for a long time because it's famous in like the bozo zoku community sorry for butchering that name there we go timer is now enabled and we're gonna auction snipe some titties all right there we go Oh, wait, 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 wait. okay, that was fast. That was fast. Come on, that was fast. Give me the car. Give me. The... Are you kidding me? Who is Ocean Sniping with me? Who is it? This is what we want, boys. The 91 Toyota, Toyota Chase GT. Oh, it's a twin turbo, not a TD. A twin turbo. Uh, that's what we want. It's pretty rare, but at least we saw one three minutes in. <laughs> You're putting up for- Oh! Thank you! Who do I gotta shout out? Jars 7567 Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, we got the car. Only took us 10 minutes. Uh, so here it is, boys. I like it. This car doesn't even need a body kit. Like, it's so good. Like, different rims. Slam it, and it's already a pretty, pretty nice vehicle. Let's go into the back seat, Guys, this is- how it feels like to be in a taxi. I'm sure these cars were used as taxi cars as well. Ooh, you know what I love, guys? The doors don't have frames. Oh, that's so nice. That is pretty rare to not have a like a frame around the glass on a four-door car. That is sick. Uh, let's uh, pop the hood as well over here. Guys, is that a 1JZ? Should be a 1JZ. So, now we get to tune the car. I thought this said explode. Wait, it does say it. Can I explode the car? Hold on. So we can explode. Okay, uh, that is very interesting. Yeah, it was about to fly, I swear again. Ooh, wide body kits. There's only one? Oh, it's something. Um, I expected like more options here. I kind of don't even know if I want the body kit anymore. Okay, yeah, let's go without because we can slam it and put some nice rims on it. Stock drive train is railway drive. We're not gonna make it all with drive. We are not. Okay, it's fine. Let's get out of here and upgrade everything over here to the max to get some power. Now, you don't have to upgrade to the max, but uh, I like how you can take like long corners in Forza if you upgrade to the max. Hold on, hold on. Engine 10 sounds. <laughs> Ooh, the pops though. I think I want the pops. All right, uh, engine to the max too. Everything over here. Uh, twin turbo with anti-lag. No, 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 no anti-lag, please. Okay, this max out as well. And I think we're done with the engine. Now, brakes. I mean, where we're going, we don't really need brakes, right? Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't care about brakes. Suspension, boys, slamming. We're gonna slam the car, this is stuck. And boom. That's a pretty decent slam. That's pretty okay. Okay, we're gonna use these. We're gonna stiffen this car nice and nice and stiff. Um, get this over here. Weight reduction, obviously. Race clutch. Transmission. We need like a, not a seven speed. I feel like this one is fine then. Let's go with this. Differential. Race differential, maybe? No, there is a drift differential. Let's go with that. Drift tires. We're gonna bring the wheels out. Dude, this thing already has camber a little bit. This is what we need. There we go. Here we go. We need to bring the wheels out. It's flush with the car. I like that. Oh, rim size. Yes, let's make this bigger. Now is the most important part. Ladies and gentlemen, we need to pick a rim that fits the car. Let's try the first category first. Wait, hold on. These already look pretty okay. Kinda like these. I think something shiny, right? And maybe deep dish. Where is the perfect rim? I want the dish. Wait. Wait, hold on, hold on, boys, 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 boys. That's kinda what I envisioned. So these are two-piece rims. We're grabbing these. Oh! 
Hey, we actually have two spoilers over here. Never mind. Hold on. Forza 1. And now, ladies and gentlemen, let's check it out. Actual Toyota spoiler. Boom. <laughs> you cannot make this up, Forza. It's just Forza developers. If you're listening, go suck a duck. Okay, go suck a duck. You know what? We're making a draft build. Let's just put on the stupid spoiler, the one we have. Okay. Oh my god, that's a lot of weight. Hold on. I didn't know it was going to be that much horsepower. 1.1 thousand horsepower. I might have overdone the engine upgrades. But we need to tune this bad boy. Five minutes later. Boys, first impressions. Okay, fourth gear. Okay, all right. I feel like I did a good job at tuning. Maybe slightly less horsepower would be better. But for longer corners like this, yeah, it's pretty good to have like more horsepower, I guess. Handbrake feels nice. Yeah, you don't, if you do a drift tune, you don't need to like add any brake upgrades at all. Yeah, I should upshoot into fifth. So that's what I mean. Like, I feel like we have to do one final thing over here, which is the gearing all the way left and even extend these. Just a little bit. We're gonna extend this, save, and now it should be way better. And let's see. Clutch kicking. Yeah, fourth gear. Oh, fourth gear is so much better now, boys. I feel like I have to lower my force feedback. Yeah, that's what I mean. The car almost always steered, but if you use like any older muscle car, it doesn't. We are testing this car against the other new cars. So, two new ish cars in Forza, which I haven't tried yet. We're gonna try out today and compare JDM against Maso. This honestly feels like it's a pretty decent drill build. I feel like on a like a scale from 1 to 10, I would give this for drafting 7.5 even. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's just it's lacking that angle, which is a problem with any JDM car. But 7.5. Oh, we're in a drift zone as well. Wait, hold on. Let's see if I can beat my PB. Last time I played Forza, I took a random car. And managed to make it into a crazy drift build with Ryzen and I beat my PB. I want to know, can I re-beat my PB with this car? Right, we're actually looking pretty good on the score. Hold on. Hold on. Wait, I think I... Did I just do a new PB? Wait, hold on. Boys. You can't make this up. I got a new PB with this car. I mean, it was really close, but I still beat it. I feel like it was 148, the previous PB. And now we got 151, right? So it, pretty close call, but we managed to beat the uh, the PB over there. Okay, nice. So this car is 7.5. Oh, I love the rims though. I love the rims. But yeah, it's lacking body kits. It's actually lacking body kits. Now, boys, we do have... A second car as well, which is also kind of a new car in this game. Hopefully it is easier to get. Do you know what car I'm talking about? So it, it was one of the hype cars. They even released like a trailer for that car. And we have to find Chevrolet Camaro Forza Edition 69. Nice, by the way. Very nice. And this is the car. Oh, okay. This, okay. It's only cost 1 million. Dude, look at this thing. That's a cool car. Okay, we got bucket seats. Yeah, that's a custom car. I don't remember even seeing like bucket seats in Forza. Can I jump in? I can. Very nice. Okay, let's get out of here. Design and paints. Okay, let's see all the liveries. Dude, yellow is kind of cool, no? Guys, are we... Vi oh, hello. <clears throat> focus, boys, focus. Do we like the yellow? And I'm not talking about the... The girl over there with the yellow dress. Maybe this one? That looks pretty nice too. With the stripes. Ooh, or a baby blue. Muya color. Okay, we're going with baby blue, boys. Here it is. Here is the baby blue. Oh, it's gla Glacier. It's a nice fresh color. We need to get some nice rims over here. Either full chrome or like golden combined with chrome. Or this one. Okay. Yeah, I feel like it's pretty muscly. Like it kind of like fits the car oh we can't even swamp the engine we can get twin turbo i mean it's it's dude, it's a us car i feel like we should go with the uh, supercharger right let's go with the supercharger and over here we're gonna obviously max everything out because why would we not you know we don't even need to do these there's like big upgrade over here right and that's already enough power i don't even need to do the rest of the power upgrades uh breaking we don't need unless we need the suspension 
Oh my god, look at this slam, dude. Wow. Dude, that is, that is slammed. And differential, drift differential. Rims are fine, these are fine. And the car is okay, we just need to tune the gears. Yeah, uh, 900 horsepower, I feel like it's perfect on an old muscle car. Let's do a quick test. Dude, it's already smoother though. Dude, I can already feel it has more angle. I'm telling you, boys, this car is already better. Now, there's something with tuning. This car would actually, yeah, need more horsepower. Dude, it's gonna be absolutely banger. I wanna actually make this perfect and share the tune code as well with you guys. Because we can make this good. Right now, it feels really heavy. Guys, I'm gonna share you this tune after it's done. You guys are gonna thank me. You guys are gonna be, like, begging me on your knees. Like, Ghost Senpai, Ghost, thank you for the tune. It's so good. It's the best car I've ever drifted. Ghost, what can I do? Just stay patient. I'm gonna make the tune happen. Thousands of tears later. Okay, let's try with... What is the stance right now? Okay, nothing too crazy. Okay, let's check it out. Hopefully it's lower. Wow, wait, something feels... Whoa! Wait, what? Huh? Wait, car is slow now. Dude, it's like full turtle mode now. It was probably uh, the toe, I think. And the camber. Yo! Wait, ladies and gentlemen, we actually fixed the car. Max camber with toe out. Damn! This is what I wanted the car to feel like by default. Look at this. I can finally do all these long corners without it snapping like crazy. Oh, that's good. Okay, fourth gear is nice now as well. Even though I'm revving the limiter, it doesn't feel like I'm running out of power when I'm revving it. Like I'm still gaining speed and accelerating. And fourth gear, even on slow corners right now, pretty okay. Doing a little bit of clutch kicking, but that's fine. It can go way wider than it could earlier. Guys, this is the tune. This is the tune. Yeah, yeah, Okay, it's so much better. It is actually fun to drive now. <laughs> Wait, I'm actually having fun driving this car now. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Hey, we made this work after all. The share code for the slow tune 999201083. Don't worry about the camber, it's maxed out to make the car slower and smoother. Alright, uh, beautiful. Uh, this car, compared to the JDM car now, with this tune, I would say is... Hold on, let me see, let me, let me just do a corner over here. I feel like it's... it's 8.5. What was the other one? Oh, 7.5. 7.5 was the JDM, and this muscle version is 8.5. More angle, and now it's smooth as well with the weird tune we just did. So, uh, JDM 7.5, Muscle 8.5, boys, Muscle wins. Sorry, JDM fanboys. Uh, and, uh, boys, if this is a video, uh, like and subscribe, and as always, stay sideways. Peace!